All right, guys. It's metal detecting time. Heading out. Go to the homestead. I got a new secret weapon. Four and a half inch coil for the AT Pro. I'm still waiting on my Noctra Macro the Legend. It's on order. Should be here by the end of the month, so definitely gonna have fun with that one. All right, first find a little 22 room fire. It's Peter's. Pretty beat up, but we'll take that. Cool. It's like a little piece of the steel grate. Maybe part of the wood stove again. Who knows? Keep going. That is a square now. Cool. We'll take that. Oakley. Just a little grommet. That one's kind of pretty. I don't know what it is. It's definitely a part off of something. Looks about the size of a maybe a nickel. Some kind of decoration. Cool. Another little, I don't know, it's got like a waffle stamp on one side. Perfectly round hole on the other. Put it in the baggie. All right guys, so been out for about an hour, taking a little break. Thought I'd give you a part way through the hunt. Low down, got a bunch of junk. Nails. Big freaking tack. Bunches of glass out of the ground. Cool finds. Square nail. Grommet. Don't know what this is. It looks like a brass decoration of some type stamp. I don't know what these are either. And this looks like part of the stove. So we're getting a few things with the new coil. Kind of fun. We'll finish our break and get swinging. I'll see you on the next thing. Looks like 223. 5.6. 5.56. Five, five, sorry. Or 223. Same thing. Cool. Keep looking. All right, head stamp time. American Eagle number 12. American Eagle is produced by Federal Cartridge now. They are still in business and selling ammunition under that name. This is definitely though an older one. I can see the red paper across it. Focally. Number 12 on there, that's in good shape. We like that, we'll take a head stamp any day. Swamp Rats on the board. Ready. Head stamp number two. Western Super X, number 20. Cool. Swing on. More munitions. Federal cartridge, 30-06 Springfield. It's been there for a good long time. Keep looking. Winchester expert. I think. Kind of hard to read, but that's okay. We'll take it. We're on the road now. Western Super X. Number 12. In the bag. Not a very old one. That's plastic. Popular round out here on the homestead, 30 carbine. This one's a civilian. The Winchester repeating arms, 30 carbine, it says right on it, so. Still cool, and we'll take it. Another Western expert, number 12. We'll take that, only about three inches down, maybe. Two to three inches, sweet. Another Western expert, number 12. Paper cartridge this time. That one's a bit older, Winchester New Black. Sweet. In the bag. Oh, that's a 20 gauge. Yellow plastic. Can't really make anything out on it. Maybe if we clean it up a little bit at home, we might see something, but not high hopes for that one. Keep looking. All right.
do that. 84, 85. That's a penny signal. And out here, that could be a wheat. Let's see if we can find her. She's up in the plug. Well. That's not a penny. I don't know what that is. You get it cleaned up and we'll have better luck. Still not a clue. It's got flattish edges on one side. Looks like it might have some writing down here. Don't see anything but sand on the inside. Definitely sounded good. Got some weight, but that might be just the sand. All right, well, definitely a what is it. That one was pretty deep. I'm gonna get some sunlight on it. It's a modern dime. Don't think she's silver. Can't read a date right now. I have to clean that up. See if we can get a date on it. Definitely crusty. We'll keep looking. All right, so quick wrap up. We ended up with eight head stamps. We got the 30 cal carbine, the civilian one. That's the um. Winchester repeating arms. We found us 30 out six, one diamond clad, some lead, an eyelet, probably two, a shoe. I don't know what these little lead pieces are. They look like they might have had a nail or something on top of them, so maybe a roofing a piece of roofing lead. Um, I'm guessing this is 223 or 556. Single clad dime. We found this cool little pretty, it looks like it's a brass piece stamped, probably attached to a piece of furniture, decoration for a piece of furniture or something. Um, six, nine millimeter. And then we found this mystery item. This was one of the what is it items that I put up. Turns out the consensus on this one. I was having trouble identifying is that this is an old car wheel hub like a Model T style center hub cover it would have gone right in the center of the wheel pretty cool we have found other car parts so it's definitely in the range of coolness all right anyway you get a chance you get out there see the sights, swing that detector, walk around exploring, find cool stuff. Hope everybody has a good day. Bye.